So, what do you have to confess, baby? Frankie, honey, you know when you told me that you wanted to put the elephant in your father's coffin, I didn't want to stop you. Yeah, and you didn't. So, what's up? I couldn't bear to part with something. Something from Jesse. It was one of the last things you touched. So Frankie didn't throw the toy that I bought him into the grave, did No. You? I went out and found the exact same elephant. And switched them. So the original is still out there. And the substitute was in the coffin. And Papel, or whoever, cut it open trying to find something. I couldn't possibly find whatever it was because they were looking in the wrong elephant. But whatever Papel wanted is still out there somewhere in the original elephant. So where's the original elephant now? I don't know. Are you sure? Yeah, I mean, something so special, you, you must have kept it somewhere safe, right? Remember your sister's Mr. Trunks? You mean Cassie's old elephant was the one that Dad bought? Yeah, I, I let you think I'd bought another one. So, so where is it? You gave it to Cassandra when she was a baby in New York. But when Cass went off to school in Paris, I packed up a lot of things that she had grown out of. Including the elephant. Well, I thought it was time to let go of the toy. So I gave the box of things to a charity in the city. There's no way you can find that toy now, Dad. Well, we'll never know until we give it a shot, right? And whatever Papel wanted, he took 20 years of my life for it. Now, if there's even the slightest chance I can get out there and find this thing, I gotta go for it. I'll be right there with you. Will you two please stop? You're being unrealistic. Yeah, what are you gonna do, Dad? Knock on the door of every family in New York? If you ask to. You've become obsessed, Jesse. The elephant is gone. What Papel wanted is gone. You have to accept that. Please, for all of us. All right. If it's going to make you happy, I'll drop it. Thank you, Jesse. Thank you. Dad, you can't drop your mission, can you? Hell no. It's entirely different. I've been looking for Kate for years. I'm not about to stop now. Jesse needs to forget his case. You have a case you can't forget. Why don't you help Tad find Crystal, his daughter? It's okay. I've got it. No, Jesse, you, you could do some good here, baby. Nobody wants to get involved in a cold case. Somebody who likes a challenge would. Somebody who wants to help you. Somebody who needs something to take his mind off his own deal. Jesse came back to us, and that was a miracle. Maybe he could do the same for you, Ted. What do you say? You want in on this? It's your call. Well, I think Dixie would love some help from an old friend. Well, this old friend would love to help. Cassandra, baby, is that you? Hey, Mommy, how are you? Well, better now that you called. How's Paris? You know, what's the weather like in Pine Valley? I love you. What do you mean? I thought it was time I showed my face around there. Cass, honey, don't play your mother. Well, I gotta meet Jesse. It's time, right? You sure? I'm nervous. Never met a living legend before. Well, he wants to meet you too, honey. Okay, Mommy, I gotta go finish packing, so I will see you tomorrow. Tomorrow? Surprise! Bye! <laughs>